the ease of, of uh, just walking and, 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 and uh, the uh, comfortableness of it. This so is really fantastic. How many miles do you figure you've walked for I walk? so far. Oh, a marathon. Almost a marathon. Uh, how long have you worked here? Since May of last year. Now, how did you first lose your leg? Uh, it was a recreational accident uh -huh. in 2002. My amputation was in uh, March of 2010. And can you explain about the power assist that makes the difference? Well, the, the ease of the power assist when you're going up a ramp is it actually replaces your old ankle. It, 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 it mimics your ankle. So that when you're walking up, it's as if you still have an ankle. You still, it, it's as if you never lost your leg in the first place. I just started yesterday with putting the biome under the knee that I have, which has the capability to ascend steps, but I couldn't make it work. So I don't know whether the biome helps the knee better, but it, I was able to ascend steps on a consistent basis yesterday. Okay, so you want to try it again? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I put the biome on about 11 o'clock yesterday morning. So that's how long I've been on it. And all on the same with the same knee. Are you trying different knee I'm combinations? Different knees with the, with the biome, and then also different knees with different feet, so that I could feel the difference and give them feedback on what it felt like. I'm a swimmer, so my prosthesis doesn't really play into it for my sport, for my activities. However, my day-to-day -day life, I am a mother of four. My kids are nine, seven, five, and two. So I have to be on my leg. So whether I'm at home or whether I'm at work, my leg has to feel good and it has to last. It has to be something I can put on at six o'clock in the morning or take off at 11 o'clock at night. 